welcome this is mel skinner and we're back with some more xenonauts and we have two more aliens left to deal with i'm gonna go ahead and use this shield to fire on this guy finishing him off okay and let's see if our other shield can finish off the other guy so i'm gonna just come right up to the door he is suppressed I'm gonna drop down on her knee and we're just gonna unload on him Okay, well that's going to be our two shots that I can pull off. Okay, rest of my squad. I think I'm going to have to go the long way around here. Unlikely the alien's going to be able to um, come out and kill this guy, so having him out a little bit in the open is okay. Okay, we'll have to see what happens this next coming turn. Unfortunately, my sniper doesn't have a whole lot of things you can do. And just so I don't shoot my own guys in the back, I'm going to just move him away. Unfortunately, we do have this enemy suppressed, so it's probably unlikely going to do a whole lot. It did suppress us in turn, though. But now we can just use the suppressed shield here to open the door. We'll go ahead and use our other shield to pop him. Okay, suppressed him, got him, finished him off. Okay, there we go. So we have a number of our soldiers being promoted to corporal, which is fantastic. We're going to see a lot of stat upgrades here, uh, big, uh, important uh, stat upgrades. And hopefully we get some good money here as well, 34000 So hopefully we can get that uh, Foxtrot built as well. Okay, with that mission completed, we also have Charlie 1 out uh, getting ready to contact this alien. Now, more than likely going to be during the night, and I don't know if I can delay Charlie 1 too much, so we're probably going to have to take the night engagement, which is going to make things a little risky, but uh, let's go ahead and move forward here. Okay. Now, first things first. I already know that a single condor is not enough, unfortunately, to take down a uh, UFO a lot of the times, unless it's one of the tiny ones. So, I'm probably going to have to build another hangar here, unfortunately. And I think I am going to transfer one of the condors from hole two, though. So... I believe that's something I can do, so... Um, I forget how to do that, though. Uh... No, I don't want to buy another one. I know for a fact you can transfer planes, I just I can't remember how I do that. Don't have... Well, the, these ones aren't refueled. Okay, I'm going to have to wait for them to refuel uh, before I, I may have the option anymore. Okay. Hopefully I can remember to do that. Okay, one of them has been... Um, all right, well, we have to engage or abandon the mission. Uh, as much as I could have the Charlie go back and forth until it's daytime, it's going to take too long, in my opinion. We're just going to go ahead and engage. Anyway, this is going to give us more cash, so we will be able to build another hangar, perhaps. I don't have a radar dish up, I just realized. Okay, so this is our first night mission. It's letting us know that doing night missions is not really a good idea. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to grab uh, one of my shotgun uh, or assaulters. We're going to throw out a flare. Uh, usually speaking, throwing it out as far as you can is usually a good idea. It's going to give us a little bit of light. I think I'm just going to continue to use her in that capacity. So, throw one over here. 
we botched that throw a little bit, but at least it gives us a little bit more light. I'm going to go ahead and take the shield out this way. This is going to be the edge of the map here. Looks like we've got a little ways to go that way. Take this shield out this way. I'm going to really have to remember to set up my dropships better. Okay. Throw out another flare. Throw it over here. Okay, I don't know where that one ended up. It probably ended up right in front of me. Let's see if we can do this more successfully this time. It's possible I don't have the angle because of the doors, but... There we go. That's where I wanted it to end up in the first place. We're going to have more wooded train here. I'm alright with moving up here with my shield. I have a ways to go over here before hitting the edge of the map. Yeah, flare went right there. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and have this rifleman back up here. And we'll go ahead and take a knee. Okay, our sniper is going to run up here. Is going to throw a flare out as far as he can. Then he's going to take an E. Did waste a lot of my action points messing around with the flares, so. Machine gun. I'll have pop in here. Any? Have this rifleman pop over here. Throw a flare as far as I can here. Okay, and take an E. Fortunately, the shield will not be able to go any further that way. So, have the shield start moving this way instead. E. We'll have her face more that direction in case something happens. Okay, I think we've moved most everybody. Let's go ahead and end the turn. We've got an alien at the edge of our vision. Oh, I forgot to move our assaulters. That's no, my bad. But they're actually in not a bad spot right now. To engage, perhaps. Oh, our sniper has a clear shot here, so might as well go for it. Uh, what can we get? We can get two of these, right? No, I guess not quite. Okay, unfortunately, we missed there. Need 18 to be able to shoot. So if I move here, um, that should be enough to get a shotgun blast off. Go ahead and take an E. Fortunately, we missed. Earn shot. So we can get one of these shots. Managed to hit once. I'm taking a bit of a risk with my shotgunners. This guy can get away with a little bit closer. I mean, a little bit less. But uh, shot's still gonna be. All right, good. We got a kill there. Uh, that wasn't a great chance, but 
Still managed to pull it off. Okay. Flip back around here. Throw a flare out. And take a knee. I'm going to face in this direction, though, so we can cover a couple different directions. Have you pop over this way? Okay. Um, I'm just going to take an E here. Alright, let's take a look in this room. Okay. I'm sure the best way to approach this area. Take an E. Have these guys facing a couple different directions so we don't get caught off guard. Alright, well, let's hit one alien down. Let's see if we can get the other ones taken out here. So, end turn. So, here's some action going on at the UFO door. Start with a flare. Actually, this guy's pretty weak, so uh, not going to be able to throw it very far. Give us some vision. Go ahead and take a knee here. Have a shield pop up. Throw a flare. We have a ways to go for the edge of the map. Go ahead and pop an E. Green gun. And come over here. Pop the door open. There's an alien in these woods. Be a fair amount of trouble because uh, finding them is going to take some doing. Go ahead and take an E. That direction. Let's throw another flare out. Starting to get close to the edge of the map here, so... Don't think there's going to be anything over that way. Go ahead and take an E this way. Not likely going to be over the, anything over this way either, but I'm just being cautious. Go ahead and have our sniper move in here. Take an E. Have her move up. See another alien. Well, where we are, we don't have much choice here. Um, what I could do is I could throw a flare at it. Ensure we've got good lighting for our sniper. Oh, well, that sucked. I'm half tempted to just run. 
Uh, I don't have cover if I do that. Hmm. I'm gonna... I'm gonna try and... Okay, we've got more than one enemy firing on us. Okay. I don't like it. See if we can get an another flare throw here. Now we've actually hit him. All right. Hopefully we can get a shot off now with our sniper. And it looks like that's going to be the best shot I can get. Did manage to land with that. Okay. Who else needs to go? I think that's everybody. So now we're just going to have to end the turn and hope that this doesn't turn out bad for me. Okay, so they haven't shot at me. That's good. Possibly they didn't see me. I also had something moving over here. That could have been a civilian, though. Okay. Um, I still have a shot here. Let's go with the... Uh, the aim shot, I think. Managed to get a hit there. Alright, so I'm going to treat it like this might have been something bad, so start moving over this way. And I'll chuck this over there. So about there. Okay, nothing yet. Okay, we see an alien. Go ahead and drop to our knee. They're going to be much better off doing that than anything else. Fortunately, we have a terrible shot. I might have wanted to get in this cover before I dropped an E. I probably still can, to be honest with you. Okay. And that's why we go through the, the woods. Hopefully there's no other aliens here, because I am taking kind of a gamble. It's a gamble for position. Okay. Now the question is, what do we want to do with this assaulting, these assaulting soldiers? Um, I could get them into cover to make sure they don't get killed here. I could charge and go for shotgun blasts. The problem is I have to cover the ground, and if they have reaction shots, they'll, they'll murder me. So, probably take it easy. I mean, I've got a good spot here with my sniper who should be able to lay into this guy pretty uh, nicely. And this guy shouldn't be able to flank me too hard, I would assume. But he could just go this way, and then I'd lose sight of him. But there is another alien out there. So if I charge that other alien, let's say it's over here somewhere, will be able to murder me too. So, I think we're going to have to err on the side of caution here. So I'm just going to get into a nice covered position here as much as possible. Okay, so got a lot of action. Fortunately, this might be the quiet sector. Not a whole lot is going on. All right, uh, can we throw out a grenade? Um, no, we were a little shy of that. Um... Should be careful here though because i am starting to come out a little bit into the open so let's uh let's move over this way a little bit more over this way take our knee let's face this direction okay well this is a good point i think to go ahead and put a cut in the video so i hope you guys have enjoyed this is mouse gunner signing out